Welcome to the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. I'm Meg Storms. And I'm Jason Strudwick. Today at one of the oldest private golf courses in Edmonton, the Royal Mayfair Golf Club. This beautiful course is right in the heart of the city while tucked into the North Saskatchewan River Valley. It's a track that's been pampered since 1922 and is the two-time host of the Canadian Women's Open. Our guest today is usually the one asking the questions. We're reversing roles for this one as we welcome in TSN Sports anchor, Brian Mudrick. Well, this is really weird. It's like seeing Superman without a cape on. Where's the three-piece suit, my man? Uh, it's, I got a Speedo underneath these white <laughs> pants. I wore my boy size small white pants for this uh, show, so uh, I'm ready to roll. Happy to be here, though, guys. We're intimidated today because we know that you showed up like three hours before just yeah. to get your range time in, and you're a player. Three yeah. hours before? Are yeah. you at Toronto time still? <laughs> Eastern Standard Time? No, I, I learned a long time ago the only thing you got to do is roll a few putts because uh, if your putter's hot, golf's pretty easy. Oh, we should have had him on on episode one to teach us that Oh, okay, one. yeah. That's, well, you got six more, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's <laughs> You'll figure it out. It's okay. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to put you to the test right off the bat. We're going to go out to number 16 here at the Royal Mayfair and meet up with head golf professional Matt Johnson. He's going to give us a tip. And now it's time for the pro tip brought to you by ATB Classic. Now, Maddie, we're in a par three. What have you got for us? Well, today we're on the 16th hole. It's 123 yards, which uh, typically on a flat shot, you'd be comfortable hitting whatever your 123 yard yeah. club is. But on an uphill shot, um, I find a lot of amateurs still take the 123-ish yard club and try to hit it just harder. So sure. we're going to learn a uh, controlled knockdown shot today. I take a little bit more club, a little less variable on left and rights, and we'll try to hit it close to the hole. All right, show us the way. All right. So today we're going to talk about the knockdown shot. It comes in handy when you need to uh, hit a little further just outside your maximum distance of one club, but a little not far enough for the other club. So today I would typically hit a 50 degree, my gap wedge, 125 yards. We have a pin that's uphill. I'm going to use a pitching wedge today. I'm just going to swing nicely and controlled. Um, I'm going to eliminate my upper body from the swing because that's what's going to make it go left or right. So uh, technically we're going to just move the ball back in our stance a little bit. So I'm just behind center of my chest and I'm going to shift my weight slightly to my left side. So my front side, probably a 60-40 split this time. I'm going to leave my weight there. So after that, all I'm going to do is get my hands ahead of the ball. And then that last thing I need to remember is keep turning with my lower half, okay? If I don't clear my left hip, the ball is going to go left and short. So we need to really spin out with our left hip and that should create a nice flighted shot next to the pin. Light the candle. Oh, that looks That's so good. good. Oh, that's Very sweet nice. ball. Nice shot. Yeah. Come on back. Very nice. All right, guest is up yeah. first. So Matt, you suggested maybe going with a little more club. <laughs> Do you have one in between well, the two? The, 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 I'll get there with this. <laughs> you will get no? there. That's correct. Okay, fine. And then okay, some. we'll we'll go we'll go with this then. <laughs> So I got big Ukrainian hips, right? So just get through. <laughs> just get through those hips, yeah. Okay, wow, well, there's a lot to get through, buddy. So we'll uh, we'll give this a go. I wore these white pants just to throw off the competition streds, so you're yeah. welcome for this. Throw up the competition. Yeah, don't usually, you should no. wear also after July 1st. But. Try, try to relax. <laughs> They're boy size small pants, okay? <laughs> All right. Oh. Is that any good? Is the green okay? Is that a good <laughs> shot? Oh, wow. Is, is the bunker the tip, okay? was, the tip was too good. <laughs> I went right through. He's not used to the middle of the club face. Wow. <laughs> what a chance. Stroud, that's like the best view in Edmonton from back here. That's nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> wow. Smooth. You a little right. bit right. Ooh, a couple sand shots. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Wow, come in. This could be good. This could be real good. Get up. Okay, Ooh. good lead. All right, all right. Nice lead. Flirting Thanks. with danger there. Yeah. All right, we're gonna take a quick break. We'll come back and play out the rest of the first hole on the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH. Adjusting, improving, adapting, growing. SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving is ready to work with you. Since 1985, SLH has built a reputation for being tough enough to handle any job, just like the tough Albertans we work for. 
oil field hauling, pile driving, crane and picker services with branches in Slave Lake, Wabasca, Whitecourt, and Atchison. We've got you covered. Call today. Built to last. SLH. One of golf's greatest getaways is in your very own backyard, the Quarry Golf Club. Come enjoy 27 holes right along the River Valley. The brand new clubhouse can host any event up to 300 people. Tournaments, Christmas parties, business meetings, we've got you covered. Visit thequarryedmonton.com. Turn to the golf tournament specialist for your company or charity event. The Ranch Golf and Country Club has perfected the art of making your day a success. Visit theranchgolf.com for bookings. Welcome back to the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. Today we are at the Royal Mayfair Golf Club with TSN Sports anchor Brian Mudrick. After the first shots on the first hole, two are in the sand, one is on the fringe. Jeez. So we still have some short game to uh, put to yeah. practice here. But Brian, first we want to talk to you about why you love this game so much. Uh, do I? I don't know. Some people say no. no I, see, I see on Twitter you are at a different golf course every day. You know what, Meg, I absolutely love it. Uh, I'm lucky enough to be a member uh, in Toronto at uh, Scarborough Golf and Country Club. It's uh, over 100 years old, an amazing course. Uh, I think it's just a challenge every day. It doesn't matter how good you are, how bad you are. Golf's hard. Golf is a hard <laughs> oh, really? game. Yeah. It's hard. So it really keeps you coming back and, and you're always striving to be better. I love it. Which part for you is the hardest like uh, skill set? Like driving, chipping, putting, what? Explaining to my boss is why I played 100 rounds last year. It's probably the <laughs> hardest part of it. Um, you know what? For me, I find my short game's pretty good. 100 yards in, I'm pretty good. Don't let this shot. I guess that's not a very good example. <laughs> yeah. but it was 123. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Um, anyways, off the tee, I struggle at times. I'm just not very long. I got a big Ukrainian back end, and I'm a former <laughs> baseball player. So you're a former hockey player. Yeah, yeah. The swing's easier. Baseball yeah. player, it's just that flat plane right. and grip and rep. So uh, just I need a little more length. Well, what do you figure is going to happen here today? Like, would you at least put money on yourself? I thought there was 20000 a hole. Was it, what? I thought this was on already. Oh, yeah. So, it's yeah, obviously. Come on. Yeah. I didn't wear these white pants for nothing. Well, oh, right? let's get to it because we got to go make some money. Let's play out the rest of the first hole brought to you by Fleming Reed Petroleum. How are you feeling about Scruds, this Scruds, I don't, yeah. Meg, I don't like the looks of this. <laughs> I hope you give your camera crew danger pay because this could be anywhere. I think there's liability insurance or something. Yeah, did, did yeah. you guys take that out? Okay. That's a good out. How did that get not get in? Down there. How did that not go in? Seriously. You know, oh. you're out. All right, yeah, fair, that's enough. The first fair enough. <laughs> a little yeah. less green to work with here. A little more sand. That's not easy. Light the oh candle. my god. Off the tree. All right, so this is a pretty tough one here. Keep in mind there's a bunker in front and behind the green. No, no, you got this. Watch your teeth. Get in. Oh, oh I almost made it. That wasn't bad, again. actually. Sand again, all right. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out of this hole. <laughs> I'm out of you. Wow, OK. <laughs> OK, buddy, I need you here. I need you oh, big studs. time. This is just a tap in for an Alberta kid. This is nothing. <laughs> Probably got to sit down and Come hit around. a house. Got to swing around. How did that not go in? Swing around. <laughs> wow, that was close, though. Gave it a good, that was almost, wow. All that time on the putting green. Good try. <laughs> that was terrible. I think it's an out turn, hack weight. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is basically two curlers in a row on this show here at the Royal Mayfair. After that putt, I should stick to curling. Get in. Oh. Get in. Get in. Respectable. Wow. Okay. All right. I All right. will take we'll that, that one. We'll it's give a win. Trailer hitch. It's we'll yeah. give it to you. Nice. Yeah. What was that? Peacock. That was, tra it's a trailer that was awkward. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is all going to be about awkward <laughs> fist bumps, I guess, here today. We are going to go talk with Matt one more time about this beautiful golf course. That wraps up the first hole. Trailer hitch. Awkward. <laughs> Well, Matt, we're still waiting for the sun to come out, but even still, the course is looking in beautiful condition. Yeah, this year we've had great growing conditions since the start of April. Um, our superintendent has walked around this golf course with a smile on his face in the springtime, which you don't normally see. Uh, the greens are the best I've played this year. 
fairways are tight and beautiful. And as you can see, it's very green out here. How's membership looking right now? Membership is vibrant. Um, we're seeing kind of a, a regeneration in the club. We're seeing a lot of younger members. We're one of the few clubs in Western Canada that uh, has a wait list that we can talk about. Oh, so I can't come on this year? You can, but you'd have to talk to our membership coordinator, <laughs> um, Joette, and, and she'd be able to help you out with that. But yeah, we do have about 25 on the wait list right now, and uh, we roll through about 15 a year, so, so hopefully we have uh, our wait list growing more and more each year. What is, I know that there are a lot of things that you love about this golf mm -hmm. course. What's your favorite thing? Probably the proximity to downtown, but then feeling how natural it is here, how quiet it is, and how beautiful it is. It's, it's really beautiful being able to see downtown, but feeling like you're in a park as well. And the, and the course conditions are second to none. Well, Matt, thank you so much for having us out here again this year. We love the course. Our pleasure and welcome back. Thank you. We're gonna take a quick break and come back and play the second hole on the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH. Adjusting, improving, adapting, growing. SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving is ready to work with you. Since 1985, SLH has built a reputation for being tough enough to handle any job, just like the tough Albertans we work for. Oil field hauling, pile driving, crane and picker services, with branches in Slave Lake, Wabasca, Whitecourt, and Atchison. We've got you covered. Call today. Built to last. SLH. Northern Bear is Edmonton's premier golf experience. This Jack Nicklaus course is perfect for any tournament or function. Be a part of the Bear, offering a wide variety of memberships and passes. Book now at northernbeargolf.com. Welcome back to the Pro-Am Golf Show, brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. Today we're at the beautiful Royal Mayfair Golf Club with TSN's Brian Mudrick. After the first hole, I'm one up on the boys. Let's see what you can do on a par four now. It's time to pull out the drivers and play the second hole, brought to you by Cougar Paint and Collision. This is a beautiful hole. Try not to get distracted by the scenery. Yeah. You mean the white pants. <laughs> Here we go. Clearly. The try play draw for you, Storms. Just, just like this. Try. Or slice into the bush. Also acceptable. Hang on to it's it. A, it's an aggressive fade. <sighs> it's a tree line. It's you might jet be lag. safe. It's the jet lag from Toronto, it's obviously. The jet lag. been here for five days. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Wow, you put olive oil in those cab struts? <laughs> really nice. No, like Meg's right. It's like juice nice boxes. Shot. Like two Very juice good boxes. Shot. Well, I've got a new new stance I'm working on. It's working pretty well. Are there like cab models? Is that a good <laughs> job as a cab model? To the sun came out for this shot. It's like the clouds have parted. She's just tough to work with. It is. It's Jeez. hard every day. Very white stance here. Wow. Oh, okay. oh, it's a and bit of a says, hook. Boys, take yeah. that to the bank. It's a good thing that I lined up on the right side well, there. I'll, tra I'll trade you. It was an aggressive draw. 148 Fairway. yard drive. Good Highly shot. Impressive. <laughs> Brian, I know that you just recently had your golf tournament. Huge success every year, but can you tell us a little bit about the background of why you do your golf tournament every year? Absolutely. Uh, I'm an Alberta kid. I was born in uh, Boyle, Alberta, and I went to school at Nate uh, in Edmonton. And actually, uh, when I was 17, I wanted to be a, a baseball player, hence uh, the big hip comment yeah. earlier. The body um, type. For yeah, sure. the body type. Got the big, uh, <laughs> fat hockey baseball yeah. legs. And at 17, I was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma, a form of cancer. And I was just treated at the cross, just uh, right over here. And um, uh, I had a relapse at 19. Uh, so I battled cancer when I was going to college at Nate. And my family and I decided we wanted to raise money. It's an amazing facility, great hospital. I love golf. Crappy as it, uh, as you see by my shots <laughs> I made so far out here. But, uh, um, and so we decided to give back to the hospital. So we had our 13th annual Brian Mudrick Golf Classic and we've raised now 1.4 million wow. uh, over the last 13 years. That's awesome. You should be very proud. I mean, that's a huge amount of money and, and really you know, a relatively short amount of time. Talk a little bit about your emotions when you found out you were diagnosed and kind of how you, the approach you took to, to, to battle it. I was uh, shocked. I mean, I thought, okay, what do I got to take? A few Advils and uh, yeah. I'm good, right? You just, yeah. you don't realize when you're a 17 year old and 
uh, you think you're invincible. Um, the relapse that I had at 19 was really hard because you knew the chemotherapy and the radiation you went through and to uh, have to go through that again, and it was a lot more extensive, uh, was pretty tough. But I remember leaving the hospital, I'm uh, you know, 6'1", 210 pounds, and uh, well, maybe a little bit more. Yeah, um, give or take 20. Left the hospital <laughs> at 139 pounds, right? Oh, and I'm wow. wheeled, got in this wheelchair, and, um, and I remember telling my mom, I said, I'd love to raise a million dollars someday for this hospital, and she kind of yeah. looked at me and goes, what, what are you on, the morphine kicked in the kid, or what's, what's yeah. wrong with you? But yeah. uh, so our family's really proud of the money we've raised to help a lot of kids too, and we give five scholarships out uh, to kids with cancer that are going to uh, university or post-secondary to try help them. So what would the message you, you'd give to a young adult who is facing a similar thing you did? Don't quit, believe in yourself, work hard, um, and get better golf tips than I've had because <laughs> it hasn't worked yeah. out so far. I just think, uh, and, and it, I mean, anyone who knows me, a sense of humor, right? Yeah, sure. Uh, I think you have to enjoy your life, really embrace every day, and um, and believe. Talk to somebody who's beat it. Uh, yeah. The first thing I wanted to do was talk to someone who had beat cancer. So um, uh, you can you can win the battle. Absolutely, you can. Well, you definitely have a sense of humor with those pants. So congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> I checked that off the list. <laughs> you're, you're well, these are 2009. These are, this is an old blend, Mr. Rides. Old blend. <laughs> Strud's Meg, just make sure you watch this when this goes in, okay? I just, <laughs> just, just let me know with an applause or a roar. It's a good thing you're wearing those white pants. It's the uh, only way we can see you in there. Where did that go? Good contact. Might have hit that tree and come straight down. I think you got knocked branch. down, yeah. I think I got unlucky again. Yeah. Oh, hi. Welcome back so, to the show. That's a knockdown <laughs> shot. Oh, yeah, I knocked it down, yeah. all right. <laughs> okay, up and down for par, right? Easy. <laughs> Oh, nice that looks good. Shot, sit. Sit. Hot. sit. Okay. Good one, man. Great wow. shot. That's what a green feels like? Yeah. That's exciting. <laughs> Beautiful greens Great here shot. at the Royal Mayor Fair. <laughs> <laughs> nice to find them. Okay, Meg. Nice drive. I don't know if you saw that, Meg. I actually found a green out here <laughs> at the Mayor Fair. Okay, so it's my turn? Yes, ma'am. Oh. Ooh, coming in, though. Oh, you got it the little hook working. You're also you. looking to light a candle. Get up. Oh, it's gonna be a long putt. That's a green yeah. and rag. That's yeah. a green and rag. Okay. Take it, Take it a walk away. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> MC Hammer, pretty good drive here. Not but, bad. Uh, Not bad. Did the kid follow it up? <laughs> That's the key, though, follow it up. All right. Come Turn. around. Come around, little Turn. lady. Come around hard. Oh, oh my oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. I missed it by a Keep, foot. Eh, bud? Keepers. That's the difference between greatness and average right there. Work the calves, activate your glutes. Oh, Go. Get going. Oh, not quite aggressive enough. Close to greatness again. Well, you could use a butter here, Strudz. Oh, no, this is it. I okay, really love get sensuous. Seven. Here you go. Hold on that Get a house. Oh, Ooh, honey. Ooh. Jeez. Sweet Denise, little oh, uh, meat on that bone, bud. It's a tough putt. Your next two putts are good. Go. Go. Pretty stay up, putt. stay up. You can live with that That's all day. really good. That's really Great good. Great weight. I'll take that from there. Meg, you set the bar very high there, though, with that, so. Come down. You can oh. live with that. Settle. You can live with that. That's Charlie a good Summer. Take it away, buddy. OK, I'll oh, take yeah. that. That's I'll yours. Meg, your, your knees are so beautiful when they're knocking together like <laughs> yeah, that. This thank like you. Dustin Johnson, Chambers Bay. And she does the same. What? Oh, and still, and still room. Yeah. Let's be quiet. Let's, let's be gentle. I, got a, I think I got a five. Yeah. Well Boom. done. Under pressure. That's it. Yeah. Well done. Good. You oh. Peacock. Man. Weird. I'm with that. <laughs> <laughs> OK. So we're pushed on that one. Yeah. I'm still one up yeah. after the first hole. It's time to play the third hole. We're gonna take a quick break first on the Pro-Am Golf Show brought to you by SLH. Adjusting, improving, adapting, growing. SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving is ready to work with you. Since 1985, SLH has built a reputation for being tough enough to handle any job, just like the tough Albertans we work for. Oil field hauling, pile driving, crane and picker services, with branches in Slave Lake, Wabaska, Whitecourt, and Atchison. We've got you covered. Call today. Built to last. SLH. 
Turn to the golf tournament specialist for your company or charity event. The Ranch Golf and Country Club has perfected the art of making your day a success. Visit theranchgolf.com for bookings. One of golf's greatest getaways is in your very own backyard, the Quarry Golf Club. Come enjoy 27 holes right along the River Valley. The brand new clubhouse can host any event up to 300 people. Tournaments, Christmas parties, business meetings, we've got you covered. Visit thequarryedmonton.com. Welcome back to the Pro-Am Golf Show, brought to you by SLH Picker Service and Pile Driving. Today we're at the incredible Royal Mayfair Golf Club with uh, TSN anchor, Brian Mudry. Hi. Great to have you. Good to be here. Are you going to show up on this hole? I thought it was 18 holes. <laughs> I thought the show was 18 holes. You just told me it's three holes. Well, I was saving. <laughs> right? Sorry. See how good of a guest I am? Yeah. I was going to like just yeah. let you guys get in your zone. Okay, well, we right. you, need you now. I tell you what, you have four shots here to get in your zone. It's three. part four. Three shots. Three shots. Exactly. Going for Even birdie, better. Right. Number like 18 it. here at the Royal Mayfair. Beautiful hole. We are going to start this off. I'll let you go first on this one. And the third hole is brought to you by SP Coring. You're telling us you're the best golfer on the desk at TSN, so let's see that. <laughs> not, not on the desk, under the desk. <laughs> We'll see here. Okay, Strads, this one's for you then, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Get loose here. Oh, oh that's going to be good. Hold on. Be good. Hold on. Hold get down. Is there a little bit of water there? No. No, you're good. It's that's bouncing a little left, but. Sure. Should be fairway. Sure, it's right. not water? Oh, oh wow. Come down a little bit. That's going left. Oh. The right, uh, the other bird, left. yeah, <laughs> left yeah, that's good. struts if he's facing the other way. That's good. I think it's open there. Come in a little bit right. It's drawing. drawing. That is called oh, a good, good bounce yeah. to the left. You're yeah, fine. that's gonna be that's fairway. Good. I think you yeah. just out drove your guest. The interesting part about your job is all the the different events you've covered. What's one of your favorite moments you've been a part of to call? There's a lot. Um, I think most recently, really cool to be in the Czech Republic at oh, the Worlds. Yeah. Yammer Jager, 43 years young, uh, 17,000 people to call play-by-play. -play. <laughs> Anytime that guy touched the puck, skated on the ice, uh, it went off. I don't know what there was more of in Czech, beers or Jager jerseys. <laughs> so yeah. that was incredible. Uh, 2010 uh, Olympics, home soil Vancouver. Yeah. Uh, calling curling was uh, sure. pretty special as well. My first briar, uh, being back in Edmonton, calling that yeah. was pretty surreal. Olympic curling trials here was was cool. Uh, London Olympics calling taekwondo, equestrian, and judo, and trying not to mix those sports. <laughs> and imagine equestrian, judo, taekwondo yeah, yeah, sure. combined, but yeah. pretty special <laughs> to get to call, right? You're thinking about it. Yeah, I'm trying to picture the horse yeah. doing some kind of fight. Yeah, yeah. 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 Mortal Kombat style. But it's aggressive. Been really lucky to cover a lot of great events. Those come to mind quickly, though. It's hard enough to get into media, and then even harder to get into sports. What made you want to pursue this path? I just, I found that I really love the challenge. I just think it's cool because in television, uh, when the cameras are on you and it's live, especially live events, yeah. it's on you, right? And there's some, there's an energy and an adrenaline that comes with that, that you can't really explain. And it's a ton of fun. I mean, you know, you're doing a live show, sure. you're doing a live show doing this show. It's just, there, there's that energy that, you know, you can't screw it up, right? And then you crash hard after it. Well, it's amazing, really, even after we shoot these shows, I'm like, oh. Tuckered. And it's but it's not a job, right? Like it's no, it's, it's really fun. not a job. I get yeah. to go in and host Sports Center with some amazing people. I get to go cover live events and interview people and and it's neat to have other people come up to you genuine like, wow, what was that like? Mm -hmm. And it just reminds you that we have a pretty cool job. Yeah, we really do. Great drive. This is thick. I think we should mention too that this is the exact same pin placement as when Lydia Ko won the Canadian Women's Open here. My goal is to be like a 16-year-old right now. Okay. Oh, uh-oh. Uh, well, can your ball swim? Go. And that gives us a good chance to win this hole, buddy. Wow. Hey, high five in all over day. All wow. Right, let's do it. Club let's man. Take it over. Club man. <laughs> You're gonna have to harness the power in those pants. Back when I was your age, Drudge, <laughs> this was just a tap it, buddy. 
And that looks good. A little heavy. Yeah, that's all right. On the back, yeah. You're good. Back's fine. Nice. Yeah. First Bring off, it. let me apologize for making you guys walk so far up to my drive. Go. Oh my oh, God. You gotta go. Someone dialed in today. You gotta go. A little bit more. Yes, sir. Oh, oh my God. Wow. The new stance. Oh my can, God. Can you come back in. as a guest instead of hosting? Oh, should be. Put it close, kiddo. Here you go. Okay. Sit. 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 It's a good one. Right. Now come back down the hill. Come back down. No. Come on, Lydia. Oh. Go. Yeah, it yeah. is. Nice try. Nice one. Talk to your ball. <laughs> You've played here before. Oh, Meg. <laughs> what? Very what is nice. This? Very nice shot. <laughs> this ball will not stop moving. Uh, pardon? Good one. Okay, that's course good management there at its finest. That's Very a pretty good easy. shot. That worked wow. out nicely. Judging by my chip there, these are about as fast as when the Canadian Women's Open was here. This is uh, going to be as slippery as struds on a dance floor here. It's going to be... Uh, be very soft. Soft hands, buddy. Yeah. Oh, this could be the play. Hustle. There you go. Wow. Simmer. Look at that. That is really nice. That was a veteran move. Really nice shot. I'll take that one. Now you're better. below the hole. Wow, that's yeah. fast, though. Great Holy shot. Holy smokes. So, Strides, how many birdies on the show this year? Just one. How many three putts on the show this year? I uh, know you have to talk to Meg about that. <laughs> okay. Gotta go, Alice. Oh, not quite high enough up, eh? <sighs> well, Shauna would have made that. Yeah, I don't think that's a gimme. That's fine. I can yeah. it. I want to see you make this par after that awesome chip. I will try. Or not. Ooh. Take it away, buddy. Brutal. Okay, Struts, this one is on you. Okay. Oh, what? Hard one to handle. What? Oh. That's a freaking hard one to handle. <laughs> <laughs> Was that a left-handed throw? Oh, oh I'm a lefty. I have a bad shoulder, though. Do you need a hug? Come on. Are you okay? Oh, wow. You know, I'm just gonna. That's wow. a hard put, one to I'm just gonna put some distance between me and him because he's more likely it? to hit me than Do you. You wanna talk about it? You okay? You, you know talk what? Your feelings? I okay? worked on. I got a new stance, but obviously it doesn't go to the putting, so I wow. apologize. You guys are really good to your guests. <laughs> Real good. I guess I won this one then. <sighs> oh, With my no. win on hole number one. The rest were pushes. Oh, that's true. Sorry about that, I'm guys. That's tough. No, well, you well. know what? You played well. In the first two holes, you played really well. Thank you. Let's take a look at the shot of the show brought to you by Ken Morrison of Remax Real Estate. Oh, what? <laughs> what? Oh. That's a freaking hard one to handle. <laughs> 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 Was that a left-handed throw? Oh. Brian, thank you so much awesome. for coming out here today. Did you have fun? I had a great time. I thought it was 18 holes, though. I'm going to go with that. <laughs> I'm going to go with that. I thought it was 18. I was just warming up. I had an awesome time. What a beautiful golf course. Very awesome. beautiful. On behalf of Century Vision Care and Maui Gym Sunglasses, I got a sweet pair of shades for you here. Oh, that's awesome. Century Vision Care. It's my buddy Dr. Speedo is over there, Scott Levitinsky. <laughs> oh. Maui Gym, love these things. Thank now you. we're getting into the inside jokes. We should talk more about Dr. Speedos. Uh, no English. No, I can't do it. Can't do it. <laughs> thank you so much. We want to thank the Royal Mayfair Golf Club. It is absolutely beautiful here. Matt, for the great tip, somebody executed it today. Yeah. Who? <laughs> yeah. Maddie and you? Is that it? <laughs> and thank you so much for watching. We had a great time. Keep in mind, if you miss any of our episodes, you can watch them all online at proamgolfshow.ca. We are also on Twitter and Facebook at proamgolfshow. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Oh, I was the auctioneer. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was oh doing a year? Oh yeah. That's soft wow. touch. That's nice. Yeah. Pro tip. I like what you've done yeah. there. Yeah. Or those who can't do become sports anchors. Do you want a tip from a lefty? <laughs> I, no, I would no. suggest a gray goose right now. A gray goose. And then, Welcome back to the pro. Oh, Sorry. Are you ready this time? Yeah, it's like a surprise. Nice <laughs> yeah, it's like, fun, Mike. I, just saying, I only have a couple of these in here. You got. I can't believe you didn't think that was gold, John.